Hey folks, Simon from LJ Hooker. Look, this week I wanted to talk about a type of flooding um, that might affect your property, but isn't necessarily evidenced by a nearby creek or stream. It's called overland flow. Now, overland flow occurs from excess rainfall that comes off properties uh, and driveways and flows across land before it does enter a creek or stream. Now, if a creek or stream bursts its banks and starts flowing onto dry land, that can also cause overland flow. Uh, the other cause of overland flow is also when water naturally rises from underground sources. Now, overland flow is hard to predict because it depends on the severity of the rainfall, how much falls and in what time frame it falls. Um, when you're doing renovations and things like that, guys, it's always handy to consult the uh, online Brisbane City Council e-map because that will uh, give you a really detailed overland flow map. Thanks for listening and I hope that kind of explains overland flow.